Welcome back to another episode of Satisfactory ep <clears throat> Update 5. This would be episode 6. Uh, as you guys, if you guys watched the last episode, you guys know that this episode will be building and reorganizing our copper area, which is just right in front of me here. <clears throat> uh, as of right now, I dropped all my stuff that I had in my inventory into the this personal search box here so that I can pick up every goddamn thing in this corner here and re place them down after I place the foundation. So it's a bit early the the episode for a build montage but here we go. Build montage <laughs> guys that's it we're back <laughs> that was a pretty i would say long um process in rebuilding the area a couple of factory i left a like a whole row here just in case i add some more couple of stuff here Yeah, start off the episode with a quick build montage of us uh, figuring out the copper stuff. Uh, I might go wrong in a bit and add some walls to the factories because I have like three factories without walls. So I might go around doing that uh, in like to wrap up the episode a bit later on. Uh, let me know what you guys think of the copper factory. It's a bit basic, but it's good enough for now. Later on, when we get um, power more stabilized, we look on, look into um, getting the copper and other factories more optimized to suit our needs. As of right now, there's one factory that I know we have to get um, optimized, and that's the um, iron factory slash. Uh, Smart plating factory, which is this one right here. It's iron below and smart plating on top. So we may have to optimize this one a bit more. 
I might just boost it because I have a couple of um, overclocking, like 21 I got from the Christmas event. 21 or 22, I can't remember exactly what. So I might just overclock the screw production. It seems to be lacking. Well, all the production below I should overclock. These on top can be good for now. And overclocking those would cause some power issues, I think. So let me see. Can I build at least a button? See how what would I need to build? Whoa, twenty rotors. That's potentially doable. Build two new um twenty rotors. Hehe. <laughs> Right, so let's uh let me go and pick up my stuff today. Yeah, there it is, twenty-two. Let's overclock this. If we run out of power, we'd have to deal with that. Um firstly, why is it has in it? Did I not un unlock overclocking? Oh, frick. One sec. They don't have... Uh, yeah. I don't know if you're about to see. Yeah. Overclocking. Yeah, might as well. I can unlock it now. Five minutes. I'm just going to. Right, by the way, let's um, working on that. Let me get the uh, rotors made. Ah. Oh. You see what I do when I'm making a bunch of stuff. Like if I'm making stuff to make other stuff, I'd usually like select what I'm making right now. Like say I'm making screws to make rotors, I select the screws and then scroll down to the rotors so I can see the amount. Uh why do that? I need to get some more rods. Which I should have. If I don't have rods, then something's wrong. Hmm. Also, I mm -hmm. I see an issue there. I have to um, fix that up. I have one small to feed in three um, constructors at the moment. Four rods, which is. So that's going to be a whole rebuild. Probably next episode, I'll see about rebuilding the whole um, bottom floor of the iron production, especially that area. Now let's upgrade our power. So you need 20. Okay, let's sit back and construct this for a while. We just finished, um, just finished making the rotor. So, um, do I have... I have 200 of me, okay. Just making sure I had um couple I mean four. 
Oh, yes, that's completed. Uh, that's the um, overclocking. I wouldn't touch that just yet. Let me put down these two power plants. Down near the power station, which is there. You can probably see one of the four power plant tops there. So let me just run down here quick. Put this down. I'm tempted to put railings on that, but when when we come back, we'll do that. So I think the idea down here was to have the power station side by side. Like I have like enduro here and flip it to the other side when I'm expanding the power grid. Uh, I think that was the idea here. The piping is unorganized. Uh, how did I get up there? I do not want to fall in that into that cave. If you guys remember that episode where I fell into a cave that I did not even know was right under my power station. That was pretty terrifying. That was episode three or something. I remember exactly. I knew this was going to happen. <laughs> I just didn't want it to. But oh well. Wrong to happen eventually. Hope I think I went on one too much there. Oh well. Right, uh, first one, let's see. At um, and so it's too freaking low. Uh, and some pipes, it's way out of where it's supposed to be, but oh well. Ah, I love the hell. No one saw that.
And that one's up and running. I am trapped. I have no idea what the. F <laughs> Bit of a weird piping system here because of all the um. No, definitely not going to do that. So the offset is that the um pipes on the opposite side compared to the other side. All right, we just upped our power consumption from three. Is it wrong? Three something up to five something. Is it wrong? Three hundred and something watts. It went up to five. Uh, make this look a bit more stable. <laughs> These ones are just run straight into the ground other than the other one. Mm. And get it to snap, there we go. As well they use use the ladders that I just bought. No, at least I think I might expand this out a bit more in the future so that ladder most likely will be moved from there. Right. You guys enjoyed the episode. Uh let them know what you guys want to see for any upcoming satisfactory episodes coming in the future i know next episode we're gonna um just be doing a bit of a run around beautifying all my factories adding walls and stuff next episode while the factory runs and rebuilds everything re um accumulates will also be um trying to organize and optimize the iron factory next episode that'll be I'll be doing a bit of maths and calculations to see how best we can optimize that so that we have a surplus. I hate those things. So that we have a surplus of rods and iron iron plates. So when we need it to do anything, and also that we have a surplus of rotors because right now rotors are a bit of a pain in the butt. Every minute I have to go and create those by hand. So we try to optimize that production line, that assembly building. Next episode. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys want to see more, don't forget to drop a like, hit that subscribe, and click on the bell icon, satisfactory videos every Saturdays. As I like to call it sometimes, satisfactory Saturdays. Or Saturday Satisfactory. Whichever one you guys decide to name the series. Why am I stuck? Oh my god. What a way to end the episode. I'm stuck on a tree. Not for long. There we go. <laughs> what the? Oh my god. Oh. Guys. Guys. Oh. Where's my. Where, where is it? Where's. Get the writing in your hand. I'm being chased by a fire spitter, by the way. So. You guys didn't see that. I chopped down the tree and now I'm being chased.
I'm sorry. Where the hell did I go? Oh, there it is. Hi. Okay, I may have found the bug. He's completely not aggro to me. Or is he? Uh Okay, what a way to end the episode. A very uh Whoa. Hi. Are you aggro now? Nope. Nope. Okay. Interesting. Um It's very creepy but interesting. Hope you guys enjoyed the series. If as I was saying, if you guys want to see more. Don't forget to drop a like, hit that subscribe, and click on the bell icon. We'd probably see that um, first with the next episode. See you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace out.